All right, it's um, early December 65, and uh, we'll start off things here in um, here in Virginia. Um, there's really not actually too much happening. Um, you can see I basically use all my railroad capacity, and I don't really have any um, railroad capacity for um, to do much in Virginia. Um, so basically, our two cores over here are going to move um, and basically try to cut off. Um, uh, Garysburg and the forces to the south um, with kind of a, a, up to Petersburg. We do now control um, uh, Norfolk, which actually had a lot of supply. 671 supply was there. Um, the, yeah, it looks like the, the depot was um, destroyed. It could be kind of interesting down here in, in, in Georgia. We're going to, of course, target um, Johnson's three divisions. In addition to that, we have enough rail capacity to uh, send up two uh, large core to um, uh, just to um, just to the west of um, of Augusta here. Um, otherwise, the the siege on Charleston is maintained. Um, you can see, Longstreet is power of twenty five eighty two. Um, and we have uh, five divisions uh, besieging um, besieging them. Over in Georgia, the plan is we're going to bring down um, we're going to bring down three divisions from Dix, uh, hopefully to join um, in Grant's area. In addition, the two divisions will uh, rail over and hopefully uh, get over here to um, Dawson. My general plan is to then attack Polk next turn. Um, yeah. Basically, the general plan. Uh, it was a storm this turn, so maybe we'll get lucky and it'll be good, better weather uh, next turn. Um, the only. Where am I? Oh, here we go. Yeah, the only other thing is we're going to move uh, Milroy's force forward uh, two regions, and then we'll try to get a better view of what um, uh, what is actually here. That's about it, other than we will. Try to bring. Where is Van Dorn? Van Dorn somewhere around here. Oh, here he is. Yeah, we will try to bring Van Dorn to battle, but uh, don't have super hope that that's that's going to happen. But it's worth a. It is definitely worth a try. Um. All right. Uh, let's uh, run the turn and see what happens. We lost um, 15 to battles, um, actually all down here in um, <clears throat> uh, basically all down here in um, in Savannah. I'm trying to. It's hard to actually see um, where <laughs> it's, there are so many forces here. It's actually kind of hard to see. Um, where um, the Confederate force is, but basically, in kind of one of those flukes, um, what happened was um, in the first battle, you can see, you know, um, the number here of 231,000 men were were here, but the actual number that participated was only about one one core, um, and then in uh, the second battle, it was, it was basically the same. So you know, a big number were available, but the number that actually participated was um, was was very very small. It only seemed one core was actually attacking. So, well, there you have it. Um, so we've lost in Savannah, and uh, we haven't taken Savannah yet, but hopefully we'll be able to uh, take it next turn. Um, what else? Um, I assume the force is still there. I can't. I can't actually even really. Uh, I can't even really see them. Um, there was actually Polk has actually retreated um, and and left us. Uh, so that just leaves um, the force uh, kind of over here in Atlanta. Um, and um, we did win out. Uh, we did win out. Uh, where is it? Okay, so we had two units surrender. 
Um, we did win out um, in Texas. I think it was here at Fort Mason. Yeah, here's here's what happened in Fort Mason. So um, Fandor was actually defeated. So it's kind of I wasn't surprised he was defeated. I, I suspected that he would try to escape, um, but that didn't that didn't seem to be the case. Um, I think that's pretty much it. I mean, it's like what to do next turn with the bean. Um, you know, with the bean the last turn. Um, I think you know it's worth definitely you know, trying to take. You know, it's definitely worth trying to take Savannah. Um, we, our railroad here is, is cut off to our, uh, you know, to going back, so I don't really know if there's really much we can do, um, you know, I don't really know if there's really much we can do in, um, in, in Virginia, um, the, the siege in Charleston continues, as it long street, um, has power of 3,900, so I don't really think, uh, really too much of anything is, is going to happen. Um, <clears throat> is going to happen there. Um, and our forces did um, did actually make it up here, and you can see they have power about 7,000 here in, uh, in Columbus, so it probably isn't really realistic to, um, you know, to defeat that. Um, okay, that's about it. So next turn will be the last one, and I'll see you then.